All right, first order of the day. Got to get that cargo box mounted on the back of the bike. Polaris uses this system. It's like a quick system. Throw a knob into the box. So what I've got to do is mark these somehow. I'm going to use these four posts here. One, two, I think. Three, four. I better dry mount the box. Oh God, this video. <laughs> We're going to dry mount the box on here and see which of those holes I'm going to use. And then I got to figure out how I'm going to mark the box. I want this to be as quick and painless as possible. <laughs> Oh man, it doesn't hit either of these outside holes on either side. <laughs> the only two holes that it hits are right there, those two. What happened to just having nice metal bars that you can, you know, use these on, right? Make your life simple. Hmm, I'm gonna have to think of something. Okay, what we're gonna do is we've got the posts put in here and we're just gonna lay this down on top and then I'll show you a very precise way to do this. All right, we've got it where we want it, sitting on top of the post. This is very scientific, guys. There you go. And now you can see those posts have marked. Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> I don't think that is going to be strong enough to hold this box on here. Well, Grandpa didn't raise no fools, so I'm going to just measure that. 11 inches. You can't see it because the way angle I'm holding the phone. But 11 inches to the outside. And 11 inches to that mark right there. What? I didn't trust my scientific method. I'm going to make sure it's close. <laughs> this, is, this is how I feel about this whole project. See how flopping around and useless this is? Yeah, that's what I feel at these two. Why does Polaris... Ah, like, what, what are you supposed to do with this system? And you know what's going to happen as you're driving around? These are going to rattle loose. I know that. You're going to lose the box off the back of your bike. I just know it. Well, there's no going back now. Yes, I also measured the distance between the posts to make sure before I put that second hole in there. <laughs> All right, look at that. I'm kind of surprised that I didn't screw that up. It is centered exactly where I wanted it. And, and we only have two holes. I was a little worried. If you've ever seen this guy uh, hang a painting on the wall, there's usually about a dozen holes varying in heights as I go along to find the uh, right level. Some of you right now are saying, but Gary, there's no washer on there. Yes, I left the washer on the bottom. I want a washer on each side of the plastic. So I'm just gonna add a couple more of my own on top. We're gonna screw this down tight and then we're gonna shake the crap out of this box and see if it's secure or not. I, I doubt it, I doubt it. Uh, well, I got both of those as tight as they'll go. And here's the problem, just like I knew it would be. Nothing holding the front down. So the back is secure, um, as secure as those things can be. And I don't trust them. I just don't trust this locking system. Eh, well, Tom's called. I'm gonna take a two minute break and think about this. Tom's on his way over. Maybe we can think of a better way to do this. 
So, Tom and I had a beer, and we talked about all the different methods, what could be done, and I didn't want to drill holes into this new rack. But I cannot think of another way to do it, so we're just going to go ahead and do it. Well, I didn't want to do it, but I did it. I drilled a couple more holes in here. And I think I can get a crescent wrench in here to lock on the bottom. And we'll be able to hold the front of that cargo box down on each side. Okay, so this may work. I can just get a 7 16 wrench in this opening onto the bottom of a nut in here. I lock it on. I can put a lock nut on there. We're going to put one on this side, one on this side. Then we're going to put the box back on. Use our scientific method to mark where that hole is. You do remember the scientific method, right? You don't want to know how intricate this plane is getting right now. I just managed to hold everything together with a screwdriver, my teeth, and my knee to find out that this is too short when I get it in the hole in the box. That's what she said. So I am now going to hacksaw my own longer threaded... I have rod. Actually, ooh, maybe I should use the rod. Anyway, I'm going to make my own bolts one way or another because I'm not going to the hardware store. It's 9 o'clock at night. I've been out here that long in the garage. Started at like, I don't know, 6. And uh, it's snowstorm, and I'm pretty sure the uh, hardware store is now closed. And Gary cannot let it go. I have to finish a job when I start it, so we're going to make our own bolts. And there we go. I'm still not even sure I can make this work. <laughs> I did it! I got the... Front secured. Now we just have to secure the back again with our twist knobbies. And the final shake test. It is solid as can be. It is not going anywhere now. We got four points of contact. It's not quick release, which was the whole point of getting, you know, spending 40 bucks on these stupid things because that's the Polaris system. So that was kind of a waste of money. It's, just, it's not quick release. I ended up having to drill into my new rack, but I only put one hole on each side and you will never see it. I did a very good job. I'm very happy. It's solid. I love it. Now to get all this junk in the box. May the women find you handsy. And tonight, I'm handsy. We didn't get to test the headlights earlier, so I want to do that now. I'll show you this bar. <laughs> there's low, there's high. All it does is it makes a bright spot on the ground right there. And it vibrates because it <laughs> Because of this bar. Look at the distance when I switch back to low. It doesn't add any distance when you go from low to high. It shoots a beam up in the air, 30 feet up in the air, and it shoots a beam down there on the ground. There's a problem. The high beams suck. That's terrible, Polaris. That's terrible. It's almost as bad as your plastic racks.